So let's say you want to do some very basic pixel art for a game or something, but your dumbass can't afford things like a sprite and you already shelled out like 90 bucks to get RPG Maker. Luckily for you, your serving a friend Dorfty is here to help. Essentially all I'll do is just show my methods of making pixel art that I picked up from other people or just things I found via a basic Google search and just share it around. So yeah, let's get started. For the programs, I suggest you pick up any program that supports bitmap art, not vector. So Flash ain't gonna cut it, sonny. For today, I'll be using Paint Tool Sci, as I've used that for a while. You can use stuff like Paint.net, Paint itself, or those other pixel art programs. I'll be leaving a link in the description for Paint Tool Sci 2 and where you can download it. I'll also be leaving a link for Low Spec, which is essentially a pixel art multi tool. You'll see what I'll use it for later in the video. Now, let's get started drawing. Okay, so let's say I'm making some sprites for an RPG Maker game. What I do is, I just take the sample ones that, you know, come in with um, RPG Maker itself. Like when you start up a new like game project or whatever, and then they just give you a bunch of base ones. And I just essentially just throw them into Sai. And by that, I mean literally just drag and drop them. Then I make the layer transparent, like 50%. Another layer above the image, select the binary tool, pick a size, and now what I do is just, you know, draw what I want to draw, just regular size. So yeah, let's say I want to draw a Pepsi can or something, right? Draw a regular size, select the drawing using the selection tool, select the resize option, and then shrink it down to a size of, you know, the regular sprites or whatever, just so it fits in. Now you may say, Dorfdy, this is truly genius, using the resize tool. Fucking insanity. But now my drawing is all blurry, and the more I look at it, the more I'm thinking I'm going blind and feel like I want to burn my eyes. Well, that's where the next step comes in. Now that you resize your lovely drawing, you need to draw it again. Or, I guess, you know, draw over it and you know, same thing. You see, what we're gonna do now is make this drawing 50% transparent, you know, like the other one. You can also just make, you know, the base thing, like from before, completely invisible because the fuck you're not even using another reference anymore. Create another layer, select the binary tool, select the size, preferably like one pixel, and then like you can uh, double the size later or whatever. And then draw over the sketch, we did a bit ago. We color it in however the hell we want, doesn't really matter, and boom, we done, roll credits. Except no. Because now, if we export this, it'll be pixel art, right? And by that I mean if you try sending it on Discord or something, it'll be blur as shit again. Well, there go my eyes again. Not to fear, there is a solution. Remember that low spec thing I was talking about? Well, here's where it comes to play. You see, low spec has a small thing called pixel art scaler. With this feature, you can resize your pixel art, so it doesn't look like a bowl of oatmeal. So you just, you know, throw in the drawing, select how big it'll be, like how much percentage, and boom, your pixel art is now high def. Now you can upload it wherever the hell, or use it wherever the hell. I don't care what you do with it. Not your parent. Well, there go my eyes again. <laughs> 